Hey boys and gals, so uh, it is that time where I'm going to show you how I do my pictures on self timer. Um, I feel like I've kind of mastered it now, like I've been practicing for it a very long time. And I think I've just about got the angles. I mean, I'm not going to lie, getting someone to take a picture of you always looks better. But if you can't do that, if you're isolating on your own, if your mum's useless to taking pictures, sorry mum. Um, <laughs> she's not that bad actually, um, I've trained her well. <laughs> if, you know, you only live with your dad or your grandparents or like, you know what I mean, like if you live in a shared flat and you don't get on with them or, you know, we're not in, in that position now, like I say, can I have a picture? Um, so we'll feel more natural taking a picture of themselves rather than someone taking a picture of them as well. So um, I'm going to show you how I do it with my tripod. I'm not even using my ring light right now because it's at an awkward place in my kitchen where I can't use my ring light and to be fair you don't need a ring light for every picture um, as long as you've got good natural lighting or good artificial lighting that's all you need um, whew, sorry I'm out of the breath from running upstairs again um, this cardigan is from ASOS by the way and these jeans are from Pretty Little Things this is the outfit I'm going to be shooting just a little cute casual outfit that I've been in today um, very liking this like button up cardigan trend at the minute i'm loving the button up tops so i'm going to take you down to my kitchen set you up and show you how i do my timer pictures so i am fully aware how weird this looks my tripod isn't tall enough for me so if you've got a short tripod like me that is fine if you've got a lot taller one then obviously that's mint um so this is clearly my iphone here i make sure it's on normal photo um i don't like portrait mode for some reason i just don't really like it um, not for shots like natural ones so I've got a normal photo I've got flash on always live not fussed about live to be fair but I have it on three second timer I have three second because I find it easier to just get quick snapshots rather than wait for the 10 second timer um, I may because I'm kind of used to my tripod now I know exactly what height I want it on for the type of picture I'm taking so you probably think that is quite low for my height um, which it is, but I'm going to be leaning over here. Um, I'm going to actually put the picture in, um, if I can figure it out, um, through my video editing skills, if I can figure out how to put it in and show you exactly what I mean. So obviously it's quite a low angle, but I'm going to be standing here, so it's going to work quite well. And also looking through the camera and seeing exactly what you can see helps as well. So what I usually do is, I'll put you... I'm gonna actually see if I can put you here. Perfect. So obviously I'm here. What I know, I know how to lean on here. So kind of get myself sorted to what I want to look like. Lean on like I know I want to. Obviously you can see my phone here. So I'm gonna press the button to take the picture. And then when it flashes, obviously, you know it's taken. So what I do then is I go back and check. And you can see, like, how close the top of the picture is to your head. Like, if you want to move the tripod down a little bit or up, if there's too much kind of stuff in front of you. Because I like my pictures to be very, like, me in the centre and things around, but not too much. So at least, like, a good balance where you're the main focus point. So I don't like seeing too much stuff above my head or about. I like to be, like, in the middle if you know what I mean. So, um, what, obviously from looking at this, I know that that's pretty good, but if I wanted to do things, that's when I'd go back and maybe move the tripod a little bit that way, or that way, or taller, or shorter. Um, so you need to just look at it from that point and keep going back and doing it. So, so I'm sorry my phone's cracked and it's not that great to see, but this is one that I've just taken. So, from that I know that, that that's obviously just straight from the camera and I'm pretty happy with that because I'm the main focus, there's not too much stuff above my head, there's not too much stuff around the side, I like my pose, um, if I didn't like it then this is when I'd go back reflect and move a little bit but I'm pretty happy with that one, you can see a couple more that I took as well, um, I'm pretty happy with them, that one I'm not as keen on because there's a little bit more of the background I'm sure, same with that one you can see it's not perfectly in the centre um but these are really good and also to get a good angle sometimes is 
on a chair it's really handy for me because I can edge it a little bit closer like this and it's a little bit more like looking down on you rather than being straight up so if you do have a longer tripod you can always shorten it balance it on something and edge it forward and if it feels like it's going to fall I usually put something heavy like one behind these legs and then it's not going to fall but sometimes that can just give a good effect of looking down on you um which is good and sometimes you can honestly get a bit better pictures on a tripod than um someone taking because you know you can be a little bit more natural um and yeah these are kind of what i started with so you can see there that there was too much um kitchen around me um and that's when i got a little bit closer and yeah you just do a couple poses see what you like and it's really simple hey guys so it has been the hottest day in the UK so far this year um so I pretty much burnt my face and I also think I burnt my legs <laughs> um I've just had a shower um I'm pretty tanned like everywhere else because I've been sunbathing all day um and you know when you just don't even feel like the heat until you have a shower and you're like oh my god yeah I'm burnt um but I always turn around anyway so it's fine but I am going to do my makeup really quick. It's about five o'clock in the evening. Um, it's still really, really sunny outside, as you can see. Um, but I'm going to do my makeup now on my hair and just have an evening taking pictures because I want to catch the sun while it's still out. I've got a couple bits of promos to do. I've got underwear to do for Princess Couture, pictures for that, so excited. So I can show you the sets on as well. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited. I'm going to do a proper sit down video soon and then talk you through like all the outfits and the prices and things from Princess Couture and everything that's online. Um, but the underwear is launching this weekend so I'm very excited. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go and do my makeup now and I'll get back when I'm looking a little bit better than this. So guys, I'm all done. I've put my hair in a ponytail. I love taking pictures of my hair in a ponytail even though I never do it. So like, this is my hair in a high pony. Um, all slip back and my makeup is done. This is my favourite makeup look. I think I'm going to stick with this because I prefer this over like a dark smoky eye anyway. Um, Jewelry is from Princess Couture. You guys are all asking. Um, a little bit sunburnt so covered it up. <laughs> I hope. Um, and robes from Princess Couture as well. going to mention that. So it's still a little bit sunny so I'm going to race to take pictures outside now. So I've got my little headband in from Choke Hold. This is the Gucci inspired one. Um, I also got the Gucci silver um choker which i showed you and <laughs> the machino one as well um so i'm gonna do pics and then do this one as well this is my outfit so just for the pictures the ripped jeans and then like the tan top and headband guys i've just finished my day of working from home my room is a tip i need to organize it so much um just finished my day working from home um my room is a tip i need to organize it there's just stuff everywhere um needs organizing so i'm gonna do that in a minute but i'm gonna open my boohoo parcel because i want to show you this loungewear that i got um i'm very happy i've just finally finished because the weather's still nice so i'm gonna start cooking tea probably sit outside for a bit um and then tomorrow is like post office day and stuff like that so I'm just getting organised and also I'm very excited to announce that Princess Kachor underwear collection is going up tomorrow at 9am. So very excited, so I'm, that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing all night. Very busy. Um, I did end up getting a little bit sunburned yesterday, I mean you can't really see it, I look kind of brown. But um, yeah, it hurts. <laughs> so I'm going to open this now and show you. And I was so confused because I was like, where's the bottoms? But I've obviously just bought the tops, which is so annoying. So I've got two jumpers, so I'll try them on at some point. But obviously, I want the matching leggings, so I'll have to see if they go with anything that I've already got. Um, just being back on Boohoo and I couldn't see them on there anymore. They've got, they're completely sold out of the grey. They've got a pink one and a black one, but no bottoms. So yeah, I guess I'll just try them on and see. Hey guys, good morning. It is Friday today. Um, it's the start of the bank holiday weekend, but it makes no difference. Um, yesterday I spoke to you after I just finished work, um, and I pretty much spent the whole night last night just sorting out for stuff ready for the Princess Char lingerie launch, uh, which was this morning at nine. Um, super exciting. I was really nervous but excited at the same time. And there's a discount code on for this weekend for free shipping, um, which is fab. So I'm excited for that, just seeing what happens. It's only been up like three hours. Um, so yeah, I've had a good response so far. Um, 
I got up really early, I slept my alarm for half past seven, we've done a full food shop, been to like five shops, been to Boots um, as well. I'm going to quickly show you what I got. And then I also launched the new bikini um, on Prince Charlie Diamond Bikini, so exciting as well. Um, I'm going to leave it as like that stock for the moment and just sell what I have. Um, so that's what I'm planning to do, so I'm going to flip you around and show you um what i bought i just got a few like food bits and then some makeup um which i needed because i've been running low on concealer for so long i've had to borrow my mum's so yeah um and then yeah i'm literally just wearing this like gray dress from pretty little thing you see my white one it's just the same but gray um it's really comfy oh i also went to the post office as well i've been so predictive today um predictive <laughs> productive um so yeah i'm gonna show this now and then I'm gonna go and have some like breakfast brunch because I'm not eating yet and it's like nearly one so yeah so I got this sweet and salty popcorn which is my favorite um I got these salted tortilla chips but I wish I got dip but I didn't um I got jaffa cakes bubbly um chocolate white chocolate fingers which are the bomb um deodorant chewing gum i got two maybelline fit me concealers i don't usually use maybelline concealer i use revolution but i can't find it anywhere i got it like slightly lighter than my skin so it just looks a bit highlighted um and then i got two packs of makeup wipes which i needed and then my birth birthday card for my brother um so yeah that's everything i got so yeah <laughs> makes a change from my usual hauls <laughs> 